Hello everyone, so in this video we're going to look at syntax highlighting and how it can help you have direct feedback from the system to the code you're writing. So for example, if we begin by writing um, capitalized C, we can see that it's in italic. That means that this prefix is recognized by the system to be the beginning of an existing class name. So if we go and write color, we can see that this word is no longer an italic, so it has been recognized by the system of being an existing class. But what happens if we write colox? So this is red, and this means that it's not recognized by the system, either because you haven't installed the correct package, or that you, it's simply the wrong syntax, so right here it's the wrong syntax. So if we get back our color, and then we begin writing a method name. So for example, NE. This is an italic, so that means the same thing as for the class name. This, is, this beginning is recognized by the system. But now if we write, for example, next, whoop, next. This is red, this is not recognized by the system, but if instead we write it, you. This name is no longer a tail size, so that means this method is recognized by the system according to this class. So color new is something that will potentially work, or at least is recognized by the system. So these were some quick tips on how to get instant feedback on the code you're writing in a syntactic way. So this won't ensure that your code is always working, but it means it's still recognized by the system.